This is Judy Marino from the CMCC Library, and we're going to create a new citation in Noodle Tools. From the Projects page, pick New Project and name your project. You'll create a new project for each Works Cited or Reference page you need. Pick your citation style, MLA or APA, and always pick Advanced for the citation level. Never pick Starter or Junior, as these options are too simplified for college level work. Then we'll pick Submit. And now we're at the dashboard, which offers so many options like creating note cards, but we're focused on creating citations. So we'll pick Sources from the top. And then we'll pick Create Citation. And NoodleTools wants to know if our source is from a database or in print. I have an article from ProQuest, which is a database. So we'll pick Database here. And then on this page, we'll go to the Abstract Details tab. Everything that we need for our citation is on this page. We'll scroll down and see that the source type is from a magazine. So we go back up to the database and we pick magazines here. Noodle Tools gives us a form to fill out, so you simply place your cursor in each field for instructions. First we'll look for a DOI, and this article doesn't have one, so we'll leave this blank. And as for these fields at the top, check with your instructor to see if they have any preferences. Many may be fine with including the name of the database and or the URL. Next, we need a URL that's unique to the article. It's not the address in the web browser bar. Look for something that says persistent or document URL. Next, we'll look for the name of the database. It's usually listed at the bottom of the page. Remember, it's not just simply ProQuest or EBSCOhost. This one's from ProQuest Central. If you can find an accession number for the document, then add that too. Next, we'll grab the author's name and plug that into the first, middle, and last names in the correct fields. If there's more than one author, then back in the Noodle Tools form, you'll keep adding authors as needed. Next we'll grab the title of the article. This is usually somewhere towards the top. We'll copy this, paste it into our form, and just watch out for capitalization. You probably have to clean this up. There's no translation, so we'll skip this field. And then we're on to page numbers. And this one starts and ends on page 7. Next is the name of the magazine, which is listed under Publication Title. Just copy Science News, as Washington is where it's published and isn't part of the title. And then we'll look for volume and issue number. And lastly, we'll go find the date and plug those in. So we're done, and we'll pick Submit here. Now we're at this brief view of our citation. Go over to the right and pick Options. You can see that Noodle Tools will show you how to create an in-text reference for this source. So we plug in our page number, and voila!
We can also print export to Word, export it as an RTF, or save it to Google Docs. And we're done. Thanks for listening.